everyone well today i wanted to talk about uh, the narcissist uh, how to deal with the narcissist attack well narcissist uh, uh, traits they usually use a lot of manipulation they manipulate you they make you believe uh, that you are not worthy that you are guilty that you are uh, um, not a good person so they can feel better about themselves and one thing that they usually do is that when they want to change your mind about something they will come with the same arguments over and over again even if you are not even talking with that about that they will bring up that situation that annoy you so that they can drain energy out of you so most of the narcissists uh, and toxic people use uh, use black magic, okay? Not all, but most of them. And um, sometimes they use also black magic to try to manipulate you, um, to think the way they want them to you to think, so they can control you. So. Once you see that uh, uh, a topic it's always brought, being brought up by that person, you have to stop it when it comes. And I mean by like, uh, oh, you are, uh, uh, for example, you are doing a, um, uh, for a course to improve your your job, okay? And they are not liking it. So they will do like, oh, the curse, uh, that uh, curse you are doing um, is not uh, good for you. You won't have any um, job after that. It's, uh, it's a waste of time, whatever. So they will try to make you believe that what you are doing is not worthy. Okay, it's not worth it. And um, or uh, that situation I, I went through uh, about my spirituality. I met someone recently that was trying to make me believe that God didn't exist, that my gods were all bullshit, whatever. And I was like, um, when he brought it, the situation was like, uh, no, I have my faith. I know what I want to achieve, and whatever. And he was like, oh no, you only have your body. And I said, stop, stop right there. Uh, we are not going to proceed with it, that uh, conversation. And you'd be like, oh, but you don't like me talking. No, I won't, because I know what you want. You want to discuss with me. We want to have a fight. And I won't give you the pleasure to do that. So the conversation is over, okay? We're not going that way. It's over. And in this time, you are you are making solid boundaries, okay? Because uh, you know already where the situation is going to to go. So if you if you step in and you put boundaries, the person will not like so. So they they will use another form of manipulation. That person specifically used this. Oh, you think you? I am a, a shit and whatever, <laughs> and uh, they will you, try to victimize themselves, or they they will say like, uh, uh, I give you this and that, uh, and you are ungrateful, whatever. They will try to make you feel guilty, and I said like, no, you feel like you are shit, a piece of shit. Uh, the, the, the people, the person the, told me that uh, I thought he, were, he was a piece of shit. And I said, no, you think you are a piece of shit. And that's why you are saying that. Don't tell me I did say or that I do think because I don't. But you think because you are uh, saying it. So don't go, go putting the blame on me on what you think you are. Okay. That's your problem, not mine. So you have to really make the people take responsibility. If, if uh, the, the person doesn't take responsibility, uh, she won't ever acknowledge what she is doing. And she won't ever uh, be, be in, in a place 
that she can really understand what she is doing to themselves, okay, uh, the, herself or himself. And the best way you can do it and uh, also have um, um, a clear mental, um, a good mental state about it, it's by stepping into the boundary, okay? Don't let them cross over you. Don't let them f make you feel like you are undeserving, you are whatever. And um, if uh, you really need, you have to um, cut that uh, cord if uh, you really um, is a relationship n nearby to you that is really draining your energy, f constantly fighting every single day, because they will need that angriness, that that bitterness from you because they, they cannot feel happy they cannot feel a peace they are constantly in a battle inside their heads in a conflict inside themselves so they will project that onto you so if you want to clear do you if you want to have peace if you want to have mental health health and emotional health you have to really uh, select what, peop what people can enter and stay in your life, okay? So, I wanted to leave this uh, for you. Thank you very much.